What's going on guys, Spencer Clay is here and today I'm going to show you how you can make $800 a day by hanging Christmas lights. So if you guys have seen some of my videos in the past, I was using the, the Home Depot bot lights and those ones are those ones are crap. So do not use those. We have professional lights now so I'm going to show you exactly what you need to do to set up these lights and it goes so much faster. Like we're talking $300 per hour to hang Christmas lights. So let's get into the video. I'm going to show you exactly what we use and how we put them up. Let's go. All right, guys, welcome to the channel where I show you the top ways to start and scale your home service business. And this might just be my favorite way to make money hanging Christmas lights, where once you learn how this can be a stupid, simple way to stack 10 to 30 K in the month of November. So here's everything that we need. We got the bulbs, you know, whatever color you want. We got the light strand. These are 15 inch. We got the the, uh, the female connectors, the male connectors, the clips for the lights, way to cut the, the strands and stuff. And we got our connector jump line. So first off, we need to establish where our outlets are. These are LED bulbs, so they really don't take much electricity. So you can plug them in on the same outlet, no problem. And I'm hanging the jump line down here and we'll have another jump line on the other side of the house to connect the bottom to the top. So obviously we got the outlet down there. That's gonna be the male plug-in. Then we're gonna go up, we're gonna have a female on this end. So then we're gonna have a male on this. So we're gonna grab our lights. I already put the male over here. So we're gonna just kinda like, kind of trace it out so we're going to plug this in here so we're going to outline here here and we're going to go down to here so we're putting a female plug onto the main jump line. These can sometimes be a pain to do with cold fingers, but this is going to allow us to connect the lights and we're going to trace the bottom outline of the house and get an idea of where we're going to put everything. That is the beautiful part about these lights. You are custom cutting them to the house. They're way brighter, last longer, and hence are more expensive. But when you do a great job, as you're going to see in this video, this is how you can charge $700 all the way up to a couple thousand dollars plus to hang Christmas lights. You get the best lights and you do a great job. Remember, there will always be people willing to pay for the best. So yeah, we're just gonna start it right up to here. Start right there. And then we got, so we got, these are called the best clip. And they're the best because you can just literally just screw them on so it's impossible to like come off. Cause if you've seen like an old Christmas light clip, they can just like fall off. They can rot as like the sun like hits it so they can de degrade over time. These ones are awesome. Because when we when we come back in January, we're gonna be able to just pull the whole thing off because it comes off super easily. And this customer wanted red and white, so we're gonna do. We can do whatever colors he wants, and that's what he's gonna get. Whatever he wants, custom cut to his house. It's awesome. So we're just screwing the bulbs in. Very simple. Red, white. So once everything is set up and traced out, all you got to do is screw in the bulbs and clip it to the house. As mentioned, these clips are awesome because in January, we're going to be able to just pull everything off really fast. And then for the next year, we'll have everything mapped out. And it's going to be even faster because you'll already have the clips and bulbs set up for that house. So make sure you explain that to your customers that it's going to be cheaper if they stick with you for at least three years. I'll always give them a bulk year discount. You're going to have happy customers coming back year after year, which is really nice because recurring customers allow you to stop running on the hamster wheel of always needing new leads. This is how you build a business that lasts. Do do great work and keep your customers coming back year after year. So now we're getting to the end of the first story. So we're going to add a jump line up to the second story, connect everything up there and do the same thing. Trace the outline. An important point here is for any peaks, you want to make sure there's a bulb there. It looks more professional and it's these little things that add up. And this is why people are going to hire you. Yeah, some people can go buy their own lights from the dollar store or Home Depot or wherever, but they're not going to know how to make them look as good as these. Not to mention, if something goes out on those lights, you have to replace the whole strand. It's a huge pain. These lights are a million times better. A good comparison is something like transportation. At the end of the day, a car gives you the ability to drive from point A to point B. A Toyota can drive the same distance as a Ferrari, but each of those cars is going to attract a massively different type of customer. Your goal with your business is to be the Ferrari and be the best. And also, that's how you're going to make the most money. All right, so we got everything traced out. We're just going to put this up to the... Go down the peak, and then we're gonna trace it down there. So we're gonna put a jump line down to there. 
This customer wanted the peaks and the front. We use the Jolly Lights app on the iPad to design everything and the client can choose what they want. For the lights, we are charging between seven to $10 a foot, depending on the lease agreement. And most houses need around 100 to 107 feet of lights or something like that. So that's how we arrived at 850 for this job. This includes setup, takedown, any maintenance in case a bulb goes out. We throw in the timer as well. So it's truly a full service experience for the customer. All right, so now we're gonna run a, what's called, we're gonna jump this, and we're gonna light up this part, so we're gonna connect it to here. So what we need is this is a female clip, and these have like a little breakaway tab. So you can just like break that little piece away. So this is gonna connect right to here. And then we're gonna just throw this thing on top. The... All right, so now this has a female plug. So all we need to do is put a male plug on this one and we'll have power for the whole grid. So, let's see. Can we make it if we... Yeah, we'll cut, we'll cut right here. So then this guy now just needs a male end. So these have these little prongs in there. So they just puncture. That's gonna go into there once we move this up a bit. Moment of truth. We are in like Flynn. And then like we talked this end right here, but I'm just gonna go ahead and electrical tape that. Make sure we are good to go. Boom. All right, everything is wired up and ready to go. Moment of truth and boom, just like that, we have power. A couple lights weren't screwed in just right, so we'll get up and fix hey, those. Ken. Look at that. Looks nice. Not too bad. I like it. The pink one there bad. might be out. Let me look at that one again. Oh, this. Yeah, there's a couple ones we need to be screwing. And that is how you make 800 bucks in about two hours or so. This is a fantastic way to stack some cash in November, especially because a lot of other services like window cleaning or landscaping are slow. So this is how you're going to buy all those extra presents for the family. Maybe take that vacation to Mexico in the winter. But I hope you guys enjoyed the video and learned something. If you want to see my exact order I placed for the lights, clips, and bulbs this year, you can download that below. And if you want my help starting, growing, or scaling your home service business, we are still accepting a few more applications for my Inner Circle program. So I will see you there. Let's get it, guys. Peace. Thanks for tuning in to the Spencer Clay Show. That's all for now. See you in the next episode. Peace.